Welcome back to another Brisk Bite. We have been exploring the Brisk interventions from the main Brisk Tools dashboard, which you can always find at bit.ly slash try Brisk Tools. We have made it all the way to the AI IEP goal generator, which is a mouthful. I know what you're thinking. IEPs, no, 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 no. We don't want AI anywhere near them. I hear you and I totally get it. This is a place for you to sandbox and wordsmith the language with a little support before you move your goals into something like SACE or uh, an official platform or before you take them into the IEP meetings and you're just needing a place to really get your brain around the way you want to word things, AI and Brisk are gonna help you do that and you are gonna be so thankful that you did. Of course, we wanna be extra thoughtful and mindful as we support some of our most vulnerable students in the IEP process. Let's see how Brisk approaches that. We're right here. We're going to click on AI IEP goal generator. Let's say that three times fast. I'll let you go first and we're gonna go ahead and click try it. We're gonna let Brisk go ahead and open up a new document for us. Summon Brisk down here at the bottom and we're going to scroll down to the IEP goal plan. Now what we're really doing here is not developing a whole IEP, we're building goals. Uh, you know, four out of five times the student will, um, on 80% of his uh, comprehension activities, the student will. Sometimes we just really need to wordsmith those out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a goal around reading comprehension. I'm just going to grab it and paste it in there and put it here in my box. And I'm gonna go ahead and this time I'm going to choose a second grade for one of my littles. And we've got some difficulty interpreting text, working with comprehension, higher order thinking. And I'm just gonna say brisket. <laughs> so we will let brisk go ahead and generate some goals for us. It's generating those objectives within the goals, which is part of that IEP process. Now, of course, I have not put in any student names. I have not put in any student data. And I can still adapt all of these. I can go in and wordsmith. I can read it. If I don't like it, pass. Next one. If I love it and it's close, I can tweak it, make it fit a little bit more comfortably. Oh, I didn't even think about interpretation of text when I was starting to drive this. Thank you, Brisk. That's something I definitely want to include. You can drive the rest of this all the way home. So just use this little tool as your back pocket buddy to help you ideate around what types of goals you might want to put into place for your students. We'll see you again for another Brisk Bite.